Ladies and gentlemen, um, as we see, we have two chefs here, and there's an English saying that too many cooks spoil the broth. But tonight, certainly, there's not two cooks who are spoiling the broth, because I think you both serve exceptional cuisine tonight, so well done. Marvelous. I like the place. The whole setup and the quality of attendees, I'm impressed with the place. Well, I enjoy it very much because I have always considered Marini's as a genuine ambassador of Italy in Malaysia. Uh, it's an excellent food, uh, it's very, uh, very nice uh, atmosphere uh, in uh, a really genuine Italian style. Tonight is really exceptional. So far, we haven't finished everything, but it's a really wonderful to be able to taste such food yeah. in, 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 in Malaysia. Some of the dishes were uh, really, really good, uh, particularly like the lobster dish, which was very, very fresh, and uh, main lobster is always good. Well, first of all, I'd like to start with the wine. The Merlot was incredible. I really enjoyed that. It's difficult to choose um, what I like the most. Uh, the food was extremely, extremely tasty and extremely fresh. So if I had to choose, I would probably go for the lobster, the lobster dish, and especially the dessert, the sorbet was incredible. I like to see uh, my, uh, my, my, my guests enjoying the evening. And uh, from what I see tonight, everything went well, so very positive. And we like to do something different all the time. We are not, we have to think, as, we have to think outside the box. We have to be different in a culinary experience and uh, we promote things that are not uh, usually done in Malaysia and uh, for Italian, especially for Italian food. Yeah. We try to be innovative, uh, we uh, are innovative, that's it, I mean. Uh, yeah. And then uh, some, some of the issues are very, very, very difficult, but no, that means that uh, we want to be different. Yeah, we have to be different, we have to be, uh, we, we like what we do and uh, hopefully our guests like what we do. Yeah. Mm, the best was the Fregola Sarda, which is very uh, uh, important dish from Sardinia, uh, not very well known, and I was surprised to find it here. Um, for me, it was a great opportunity to get to know a lot of good restaurants. Um, I've been at the fortunate enough to join the opening festival, and um, there I got to learn a lot of new restaurants or a lot of restaurants, which for me as a new KLite. Um, it was great a pleasure to, to see them and actually have the chance to actually visit them afterwards um, for dinner. I mean, MIGF has you know done a great job over the last 15 years so far. You know, is to promote all the food places you know, and you can enjoy it in the whole of uh, Kuala Lumpur. So this is wonderful introduction to the local people as well as to the overseas people about the food and dining experience in Malaysia. The fact that it's been going for 15 years says something about the festival. Um, I think it, uh, it's always good to promote uh, fine dining and good food um, and I think uh, you know, Dato Steve Day has uh, a lot to be complimented for for, for continuing the process and uh, I think uh, the education of people about uh, good food and good dining is uh, always a good thing. We want to position Kuala Lumpur as a sophisticated city for lifestyle and uh, tourists who come here for fine dine, for shopping, for fashion. So this fits in very well. And I believe um, uh, this uh, Gourmet Festival is the one that leads uh, the fine dine area. And they have done it well. And uh, we have uh, benefited a lot from the publicity and the exposure this event has got by various media and also by words of mouth, by all the participating hotels and the invitees have been at the functions. I've had a lot of respect for, for Dato Steve Day, for the team, and also, of course, uh, for Tunkuna Quidin. I mean, they're they a great guy, they're a lovely, lovely uh, person. And because uh, this, the amount of effort and time they put into this event is unbelievable. And I think it's very well needed for Malaysia because Malaysia needs people like, people like Dato Steve and uh, Tunku and the team to actually uh, you know, uh, to do more for the F&B industry and uh, to promote uh, the culinary restaurant and culinary uh, you call it events and uh, more than we have here in Malaysia. So uh, a big applause for them because they are doing the, they are doing most of the job. Yeah, we are only participating, but I know they are doing a fantastic job.